Tan Elsa today, we have a weekly food shop from Okado. So, yeah, I've done a weekly shop at Okado, um, and I will show you what meals we're gonna make. And yeah, if you like this sort of video, please like and subscribe. And let's get on with the video. It's quite sunny today, so I don't know how. Like, it should be okay though. Right, so we've got five, one, two, three, four, five, yeah, five bottles of milk. They, they are all four pinters. Um, we get four pinters because it fits in our fridge better. Um, but yeah, we've got four pints of milk because we go through a ton of that. I think we've got one left from last week, but, oh, well, the week, uh, yeah, last week, because it's like Saturday today, so yeah, last week. Um, but we probably need more just the way it goes in our house and then we've got a big five kilo bag of potatoes um obviously that will do like sausage and mash um cottage pie all sorts so we always get a big bag of potatoes they always go within the week as well um so and then we got some fairy for the wash washing tablets for the washing machine to wash the clothes now that all this stuff here, we'll get onto it in a minute, is for this Once Upon a Meal Time by Disney. So these are the Sail Away Lettuce Boats inspired by Moana. And these recipe cards are amazing. This one gives you two of your five a day. Yeah, these recipe cards are really good. They look like having HelloFresh, but without the HelloFresh price tag. So yeah, um, we have that, and then it tells you how to do it. I mean, we, if you could check on our Instagram, you'll see the traffic light burgers I made, um, like McQueen themed last week. Now this one wasn't vegetarian. I think this is the only one that isn't vegetarian or vegan or whatever, but I, so obviously Kate will eat the salmon um, the salmon fillets, but me and the kids don't eat the salmon fillets, so we got them instead to go on it. I don't know if it's going to taste very good, but it's the only fish that they had, the corn fish. So I thought, well, I'll give it a go. Um, these, so you get the rice noodles and the five spice, the pineapple, the tomato sauce, the carrots, and the lemon gem lettuce. Now, what you do is like. Obviously, you just order it in on the thingy, and it just sends you all the ingredients that you need. There is a few, a couple of bits that you'll need from your um, cupboard, but most people already have them. But I don't have any soy sauce, so I might have to order some soy sauce from Amazon or something. But yeah, and then that will be one meal this week for t for tea. So. If you'd like a video on any of these, just let me know and I will try and do one. Um, this is the polka dot pizza for 101 Dalmatians. As I say, it's just the same as the Moana. It has all the ingredients and it tells you how to do it. So for this one, we needed um, wholemeal bread flour, normal British plain flour, a butternut squash, some yeast, some vegetarian Italian hard cheese, um, some Italian ricotta, um, some pitted black olives, a cucumber and some mixed leaf salad um this one i have made before this is the lion king one i have made this before um this was really nice this was this one was lovely um this one was quite simple as well although it says you need a food processor i just used a potato masher and it worked exactly the same so but I will probably be investing in the food processor because this is just so nice and I'll be making this quite a lot. So what we needed for this one was peas. Um, so whole wheat pasta, 
some baby some basil some cheese and some broccoli that's all the ingredients you needed for that one so and all these um this one was seven pound the cars one is seven pound and the the polka dot pizza and the sail away boat are eight pound each i think but that's for the whole thing so it's pretty good value i think and then move on to this section we've got two tomatoes these go like no tomato in the salads um the burgers all sorts um oh omelettes we make omelettes quite a lot so yeah we've got smoky ham free slices which is ours and then kurt's got the british wafer thin honey roast ham and then we have some corn mint for as i say like cottage pie i can make spaghetti bolognese um all sorts so yeah i've got that and um, got some richmond meat free sausages now we eat the meat free sausages anyway because they actually taste better than the um, meat ones but the um but the richmond one we found these ones are the nicest these are absolutely the nicest ones people always uh, recommended the Lyndon McCartney ones to me now yeah they are really nice but they're not as nice as the Richmond ones if you can hear if you can hear the kids it, um kids got them in the living room playing with them we just had this delivered and it is half past eight so yeah we have beyond burgers um now as far as I'm aware these are the ones they use in the plant patties at mcdonald's so i'm gonna see if i can make myself a plant patty because i love plant patties so i'm gonna see if i can make myself one and then we have two green cuisine burgers now the kids prefer these burgers so this is why we've got these ones like um i think and then we've got one in the freezer already because there's three of them but we already have one in the freezer because we normally have to buy two packets um just some cheese some sweet potatoes some brioche buns um kurt's fav utmost favorite mini savory eggs now he says that these taste better than the ones from the actual meat ones so that's why we get these ones and then we have some we have a family pack of eggs and some oatly strawberry yogurt and some petty flu dairy free yogurts for the kids then i have some oatly barista i wanted to try this because apparently it's so good and so nice on cereal so i thought well i'll give that a go and um, we're on to like the snacky bits now so we have like Custard creams, jam sandwich creams, malted milk biscuit, some Kinder chocolate, two packets of bananas, a packet of apples, a packet of grapes, and a packet of oranges. Now, this fruit probably won't last us very long. And then I got some strawberry, raspberry tea for myself. Um, some plant chocolate, Let's see what that tastes like. Got some prawn cocktail quavers, some cat food for Binks. <laughs> um, and then we have some twirls, we have two packets of chili crisps. Everybody loves these in this house. We do not know. So, this is our weekly food shop, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember, please hit that notification bell, subscribe, and please like this video. If you like this video, please leave a thumbs up, and we will see you guys in the next one. Bye!